Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to turn on home or away routines in the Google Home app. Um, this is on an Android device, just so you know. So a home and way routines pop up at the top here. And basically you can set a bunch of things to be triggered for when you leave the home or when you enter the home. And how the home app knows whether you've at home or you've left is one, it uses the GPS location on your phone um, and it also uses some other sensors that your smart home products might have, like mine uses the motion sensors uh, in the Nest thermostats that I have throughout the house to help it understand if someone's home or away. The nice thing about this is you can set this up on multiple people's phones through their accounts. So if you live with other people and I leave the house, it's not gonna trigger my away routine because it knows there's someone else still at home. So what I'm gonna do is show you how to set that up. So in the home app here, you're gonna tap on routines and you can see the household routines there at the top. You have home and away. I'm gonna go ahead and select home and you can see a bunch of stuff on the screen here. We're gonna look at the how to start first. It says when someone comes home, use presence sensing. That's basically using your GPS location and some other sensors in the house if you have them that are compatible. So I'm gonna tap on that. And you can see I have some information here. It says allow this home to use phone's location. I'm going to go ahead and do that, but down here you can see it says me and the phone I have and to turn on location access. I'm going to tap on that. I'm going to tap on agree. You can go ahead and read through this if you so choose. So this is saying change location access for the home app. This app wants to use to access your location all of the time, even when you're not using the app. You're going to want to allow it to do this. Um, if you want to use this feature because if it only works while the app is open that's not really helpful for you in your day-to-day -day. you don't want this app to have to be open all the time just to trigger your home and away routines so i'm going to tap allow in settings and i'm going to select allow all of the time okay again this is up to you whether you want to do this or not then i'm going to jump back and it's going to make sure um, this is the correct address so I'm gonna go ahead and leave that as is. If I need to edit the address, I can tap edit and it'll allow me to edit the address if I need to. Now I'm gonna select next and it's gonna show a map and you just wanna confirm that that is the location. You can pinch and zoom and move the map if you need to. It's important to know that this um, circle around the area that you have selected is kind of um, the perimeter of where this home and away routine will trigger. So I'm going to go ahead and select confirm. There. Now I now have that turned on and you can also see down below um, what other people have this um, activated on their phone. And again, if you live with other people, you're just going to want to head and go ahead and do this for all of theirs. Um, if you're going to use this that way when you leave the home say you set all your lights to turn off um, but there's still someone here you don't want all those lights turning off on them so you want to make sure they have this set up as well on their device now the other thing i um it can use to sense um for me it shows that i can use my nest thermostats so i've turned all of those on because it has the um, activity sensors in them the motion sensors in them to see if people are home so i've turned those on just to help make this home and away routines as accurate as i possibly can so now that i have all that set up i'm going to go back and now that is good to go now i have a couple actions on here that i've already set up um, you can see my kitchen display camera I turn off um, when I'm home because I don't want it on when people are home. Um, I have the thermostats to turn on. Um, I can add an action um, and I can basically select anything here, lights, things like that. I'm going to go ahead and select the other thermostat to give you an idea. I'm going to click next and it says automatically adjust the temperature. So 
basically what's going to happen is when the home routine is triggered, the thermostat is going to turn on. Okay. When I, the away routine is triggered, it's going to set this thermostat to the eco temperatures that I've set up in the Nest app. So I'm going to select add this action. So you can now see the entryway is added. I can also add actions like the lamp here. And if I hit next, I can have it turn on or off or change brightness. So again, this is the home routine. So I want it to turn on and I want the brightness to go to 100%. So I'm going to tap add action. So there you have it. That's how you do the home part of the routine. You can also hit the edit button up here and get rid of any of these that you don't want. So if I want to delete those, I can go ahead and do that. But again, whenever you make changes here and stuff, make sure you hit the done slash save button in the bottom right hand corner. So you've done save. So that's the home routine. So that's going to be what happens. That's going to be what happens when it senses that someone has come home. Okay, whether it's I've come home or someone else I've set these home and away routines up on using their phone location and things like that. So if I select the away routine, you can see it's very similar. I can edit it. I can add actions, do all those things. And you can see now it's turning on the kitchen display when no one's home and it's setting the thermostats to eco mode if you want. So you can go ahead and do this. And again, any changes you make, make sure you hit the save button. Also, if you've shared your home with other users, um, they can go in and change these home and away routines. And the home and away routines will be the same for every user connected to this home. So if I go in and change them in here, anyone else I've set up home and away routines on, it's going to set up the same things for the thermostats and the lights and the things like that. So you can't have um, it do different things for different people because that would just be a little bit too chaotic probably. So do keep that in mind when setting these up. But that's how you can go ahead and set up the home and away routines um, in the Google Home app. Hopefully that helps and if it does go ahead and leave a like below and click subscribe to the channel to get more helpful videos about your smart home. Thank you.